what's going on guys welcome back to my channel i know i've been gone a little while so i'm gonna be updating you on all the car updates and everything that's been going on uh first things first the regal is gone i know you only got a couple videos of that car so yeah it's gone uh my dad picked up a new truck that's what i'm gonna be showing y'all today if you can't tell what it is by now you'll see in a minute the 442 has all the chrome on it already so the next video for sure will be of the 442 we just got to take the drive line to go get balance first um, my car I dropped it off today to the mechanic shop do a little some little preventive maintenance on it and then I'll be dropping that one off to, we're gonna be redoing the whole trunk on my car well not the speaker box but the whole battery setup and pumps and all that so uh, yeah let's get into showing you the new truck all right here it is 1986 GMC Sierra C10 uh, he's had it for probably like two weeks now if you follow me on Instagram you probably would have seen it by now um, it actually didn't come with these wheels he put these wheels on it it came with some 20s I'll put a little picture right here what it used to look like these are 22s with a 315 tire on the back it actually I'm gonna get down so y'all can see how wide it actually looks. So this is 22s all the way around now. Before it had 20s. I think they're American Racing. These are US mags. Right, let me do a quick little walk around for y'all. He already changed the front headlights, so they have LEDs in them now. So he changed the headlights, changed the wheels already. Um, he actually just put a new rear bumper on it. And if you can tell, it's actually sucked in more. I don't know if you can tell. Eloy made some brackets for it and it actually looks pretty, pretty clean. I actually love the patina on this truck. As you can tell, it's all original. You can see the patina on the hood. I don't know, I just, something about the old trucks with the patina I really like. And it has, I believe, a four or six drop on it. That we, my dad bought it like that. It has springs on the front and a flip kit in the back. Oh, it has springs and spindles. He bought new tail lights for it, LED tail lights. So he'll be putting those on soon. And he actually ordered the seat for it because it has this seat in it. I don't know if you can tell. Like a plush seat from like the Regencies and stuff. I told him that's the first thing that has to go. So the new seat's ordered. He's getting the new steering wheel. He's gonna be getting put on. He's pretty much going to be redoing the whole inside, putting everything new, new carpet, new door panels, new seat, new dash. I told him to pretty much keep the outside the way it is. I like it. I wouldn't change the outside of it. Since it's all original, you can see all the patina on it. It has, a, I guess, the factory pinstripes on the side. You can see the patina on the edge. I, I just love the way it looks. Of course, you can't beat a shiny paint job, but I just feel like the patina gives it character. But yeah, y'all be seeing a lot more of this one. A lot more videos of this truck pretty soon, hopefully. The AC works. It rides really good. I drove it. As soon as he bought it, I was the first one to drive it. And I was, I was impressed. But, yeah, I just want to give y'all an update. I know I've been gone for a while. Like I said, the next video will be of the 442, so stay tuned for that. I know a lot of people enjoy that. Got all the chrome undies on it. So uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos.